Guys, Mrs. Rainey here. Okay, I keep getting this question on Canvas on through the email. Mrs. Rainey, I can't submit my project in Canvas. I promise you guys, it is there. So I decided to do a two minute tutorial on how to submit your assignments in Canvas. So if you are in your art class, like you're in art two, um, this would be what your home screen looks like. You can see on the left home, right? So you have your recent announcements and announcement is the most important thing that comes through if teacher posts an announcement. You wanna look at that right away. For locating your assignments in art two, or in any of your art classes, you're gonna scroll down to the bottom on that left-hand side where it says assignments. You're gonna click on assignments, and once you click on assignments, it is going to pull up your assignments based on when they are due. Everything right here shows by date, okay? So overdue, that's the default. It's defaulted to show by date. So unless you have changed that, it should be showing by when the date is due, or when the assignment is due. So you want to look in your upcoming assignments for the sake of all of this e-learning. Don't worry about overdue assignments, um, cross contour obesity, whatever. Don't worry about any of that. What you want to look at and what we want to focus on is upcoming assignments. So if you're in art two, you're going to see e-learning week of 323 dragon eye warm up. And then if you click on that, guess what? Click on it and it will bring up the dragon eye warm up. Right here, this blue button, kind of in the top right portion of it, is where you submit the assignment, okay? So once you submit the assignment, you click on that, and if you scroll up, you can either do a file upload, where you choose a file, like from your computer, like a photo. You can click on text entry, and it's pretty hard to do this warm up by entering text, but if the warm up or the exit ticket was to answer a question, you can click on text entry, and then click your cursor here, and you can start typing, right, in your text entry. Or if you wanted to upload a website or a URL, if you wanna upload media, you can record or upload media. If you have um, a camera on your iPhone, or a camera on your Chromebook, click record and hold up your dragon eye warm up of your scales and say, here are my scales, Mrs. Rainey. Just figure out whatever works for you. Um, and then you can come back up to this top menu and you can go back to assignments. And yes, you wanna leave, I didn't make any changes there. So, um, and then you can come back to your upcoming assignments and you can go under your dragon eye rough draft. Same thing, when you click on your Dragon Eyes Rough Draft, you can su submit a, a, an assignment. Click on Submit Assignment, and same thing. You can post a photo. You go here to File Upload, Text Entry, Media. Those are gonna be your best ways. If it's saved in your Google Drive, you can pull it from your Google Drive, okay? Um, and then you'll click that Submit Assignment on the very bottom after you've chosen it. Um, when you now, Every single one of my art classes is structured the same for the next two weeks. You're gonna have two minor assignments that are due this week by March 29th. You can see underneath the assignment, it tells you when the due date is. And then you're gonna have your third and final assignment is gonna be for your final project. So that would be your Dragon Eyes. It's crucial that you guys turn in the proper assignment under the proper assignment tab. So don't turn in your full Dragon Eye under your warm up assignment and your warm-up assignment under your dragon eye um, you need to submit your assignments in the proper place because i don't want to give your i don't want to have to have a, a minor grade that goes towards a major grade in eSchool. Canvas is linked to eSchool. Once I grade these in Canvas, it links and uploads through eSchool. So your minors need to be in the right slot, your majors need to be in the right slot. I hope that makes sense. Now, when you come down here to your major project, your Dragon Eye, one, note, uh, one quick note, I added a screen presentation here and Mrs. Rainey's now a YouTuber. If you're watching this, you probably noticed that because I'm about to put this onto YouTube. And when I grade your final project, your major project, this is the rubric I'm gonna use, okay? It's the same rubric we use in class, all right? It asks all the same questions. So you're going to submit this assignment in the very same way you submit your others, you're gonna submit it, okay? Um, I hope this clarifies any questions you guys might have, and um, hopefully you guys have found this video. I'm gonna send it out uh, on the YouTube. I just sent out a big email saying that I was a YouTuber and I'm gonna post an announcement in Canvas right now. Anyways, you guys are doing great. Keep up the good work, and I can't wait to see what y'all do.
Thanks. Bye-bye.